One of the features now available to you in your Schoology assessments is the option to look at the live progress. The live progress is going to give you a status of where all of your students currently are in the assessment process. So when you log in to Schoology and you go to your course assessment, you're going to click on the option up top for live progress. This is going to pull up a list of all of the students that are in your class. You're going to see some columns up top, including a status, the current item, progress, time spent, and flagged items. The status is going to indicate where the students are currently in the assessment mode. So not started means that the students have not opened up the assessment at all. As I scroll down, you're going to see that this student is active, meaning that they are currently attempting and working on the assessment. If a student at any point either closes out of their tab and browser or exits the assessment and goes to another browser or tab, it's going to turn to show that the student has exited the assessment. When they click back on their Schoology assessment tab, it is then going to show them as active. Once the student has submitted their assessment, this little status option here is going to turn to, sh to show that it is submitted. When you scroll up to the top of the page, you'll also see that you can tell what current item that they're on. So out of an 11 question assessment now, this student is actively on question number four. They have submitted or completed 18% of the questions available in this assessment and so far have spent a total of over 17 minutes interacting with this. The time spent updates every 30 seconds, so you will see an active count every 30 seconds of that. And the number two here is indicating how many items the student has flagged for review. So as the student goes through this assessment, you're going to see now they're on number five. And once they click on the flag items and go to another question, this information is going to update and change. So using this live progress option here in your Schoology assessment is a good way to get instant feedback during test sessions to see where your students' progress is throughout the test or if they might need any extra time. This live progress option is only going to be available when your assessment is set to have submissions enabled. So if you've disabled submissions, you're not going to see this live progress option.